Hey everybody, it's Garden Sound and Lila the Bird, and we're going to be here showing you how to download and install G-Snap. I'm saving announcements for the end of the video because I hate introductions that drag on. I just want to see the tutorial. Here we go. First thing you need to do is browse to this website here. I'll be putting the link in the description down below. I'm on Windows, so it shows me two Windows options, 64-bit or 32-bit VST hosts. I know that I'm a 64-bit, so I'm going to go ahead and click that to download. It's going to download and it's finished. Very small file. We're going to go over to our downloads folder and we're going to extract here. All right, this is going to give us two different files, gsnap.dll and gvstlicense.txt. This is just a readme. You don't have to worry about that. What we want to do to install this DLL on Ableton is to right click and copy. Then we're going to go to wherever we have to install our VSTs on our respective systems. If you don't know where that is, you can find it very easily in Ableton. Just go to Options and then Preferences and then File Folder. And you can see Use VST Plugin Custom Folder, which is right here. C Program Files Native Instruments. That's where it is if it's using a custom VST folder. If it is not using a custom VST folder, if it's the default, it'll be C Drive or whatever drive your operating system is installed on. Program Files x86, and you'll see VST plugins for 32-bit or 64-bit hosts in here. There'll be a folder for them. Uh, mine's custom, so that's where that's where mine is. After you drop it in there, just open up Ableton, and you'll go to Plugins, and you'll see that G-Snap now shows in your plugins. And that's how you do it. That ends the tutorial. If you're just here for the tutorial, it's over. If you're part of my channel and one of my subscribers, here's a few announcements. As you can probably tell, I'm ramping up to do a larger tutorial on G-Snap, and that's gonna be coming out on Wednesday. Now, the reason I'm not doing the Sonic episode yet is because it's not ready. Um, and I've, I've committed myself during season two to only airing material and content that is at the level I want to be known for. I'm not releasing content before it's necessary because I no longer have deadlines. I'm not doing the daily thing anymore, so I'm not rushing to get my stuff uploaded. I want to concentrate and focus on making content that is high quality, and so that's why I'm not doing the Sonic episode on Wednesday. It needs more time. I have a couple of other larger projects in the work now, too, so stay tuned. That's just a small video for today. If you don't have G-Snap, it is a totally free auto-tune utility. I like it a lot. It reminds me of Ann Terry's, but without the price tag. Yeah, links as always in the description down below. My name is Gardner, and I'll see you guys on Wednesday.